What up, everybody? It's Popper MTG coming at you with a sweet deck tech. Uh, I'm a bit pensive about this one, but you've demanded it. Yep. You've waited and too long for this. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm scared of what I've created. We're gonna get through this together. But uh, here is the legendary Grixis Songs deck. Now, if you watch any of our streams, we've been fooling around with this thing for ages now. I've yep. had this deck sitting around. Yep. Trying to think of ways to make it good, make it work somehow. It's forever eluded me. If you guys want to help me out, leave some comments down below. But uh, let's get started here. We got uh, 18 lands, 4 copies of Baronmore. It's uh, coming to play tap Swamp that cycles. Uh, same thing with Forgotten Cave, except for it's a mountain that comes in play tap that cycles. Uh, we got a full art foil unhinged mountain. Ooh, that's gotta be a spendy, spendy card. Yeah, I got it for free. <laughs> no why or Damn. how. Okay. Uh, four copies of Peat Bog, comes into play tapped with two depletion counters on it, remove a depletion counter from Peat Bog, add double black to your mana pool. So this is a land that adds two mana for just one card, which is pretty mm. sick. Yep. Also you get some value off of it sacrificing itself to power up a Cabal Ritual, which we'll get into in a second. Uh, Sandstone Needle, same thing as the Peat Bog, except for it makes red. And we got the Foil Full Art Swamp, I think that's foil anyway. Looks pretty foil, yeah. Uh, moving to the one drop slot, we got four copies of Songs of the Damned. This is uh, what makes the deck really, really work here. It's uh, the songs and groups of songs. There you go. It's uh, one black mana instant, add uh, one black to your mana pool for each creature card in your graveyard. So the name of the game is get a bunch of creature cards in your graveyard, uh, play this thing, have a lot of mana, and kill them with our wind gun, which we'll go into in a second. Uh, four copies of Faithless Looting, draw two cards and discard two cards, uh, one red sorcery. Flashback 3, when this guy's in your graveyard, it's just pure value. Value! Ooh. Let's you dig, lets you find the cards you want. It's yep. The, it's the perfect card. Best card in Magic, for sure. Right. Uh, four copies of Rite of Flame, one red sorcery, add re two red to your mana pool, and then add one red for each copy of Rite of Flame in your graveyard. So potentially these things could get pretty big. In each graveyard, even. Oh yeah, so uh, if we're playing the Grixis Songs Mirror. Oh, their cards are from this, right? Maybe, perhaps. Right. Uh, four copies of Cabal Ritual, our only uh, card in the deck that has Threshold. It's uh, two mana cost instant, it adds three black to my mana pool. If I have Threshold, however, it adds five, so it's pretty good. Uh, four copies of Reaping the Graves, now... <laughs> They said you couldn't play Storm. <laughs> yep, they banned all the good Storm cards. Well, they might after this uh, this set hits the internet, so... I said no. I can make a Storm deck just as good as any of those other old Storm decks. So we have four copies of Reaping the Graves. Uh, it's a three mana cost instant return target creature card from your graveyard to your hand. It has Storm, so whenever you cast a spell, you copy it for each spell cast before it. So you cast like five rituals into this guy, you can return like five, six creatures even. Yeah. Pretty good, right? Yeah. And uh, this is the new innovation here, uh, replacing Seeding Song, which is a 3 mana cost sorcery that added 5 red to your mana pool. This one is a 4 mana cost sorcery, however it adds 1 red to your mana pool for each card in your hand. So, um, potentially after you're reaping the graves and get a big fistful of creatures, yep. you cast your inner fire, then you add a sh crap load of red. So, uh, ideally this acts kind of like a Songs of the Damned, hopefully, we'll see if but it works But really out. expensive. But <laughs> really expensive. And yeah. Yeah. Anyway, onto the creatures. Uh, four copies of Architects of Will. This guy might do something. I haven't really read him, but he, uh, he has cycling, which yep. is what I know. That's, that he does that's all does. we need, yeah. <laughs> He's just a creature, he cycles, goes into your graveyard, lets you draw a card. This is the Grixis in Grixis songs. <laughs> I guess. Uh, moving on to the five drops. Uh, another cycling creature that you cycle to pay to life. Another cycling creature that cycles for black or red. Possibly the best cycling creature we have. Yep. Um, you could actually potentially cast this one, or this one. I can't imagine a world where we'd want to do that. But. Yeah, that's, uh, uh, if they stick, um, uh, Rocket Progenitus, that might just have to be our game plan. <laughs> <laughs> Monsters Caravid Beats. It's a 4-4 four, four, and it attacks each turn of Able, so. Uh, four copies of Deadshot Minotaur, uh, cycles for one red or one green. It's 3-4. Um, and our Wincon. Uh, two copies of Caravex Torch. Uh, one X, one red. As long as Caravex Torch is on the stack, spells that target it cost two more to cast, so it comes with sort of its own protection there. And uh, Caravex Torch deals X damage to target creature or player. So ideally we're going to get a bunch of mana with our inner fires and our Songs of the Damned. 
Yep. And then we're just going to blow our opponent's face clean off with a well-aimed Carabex torch. Big old torch, and we're just going to throw it at someone, I guess. I don't know. Uh, we got three copies of Pyro Blast in the sideboard. Uh, counter target spell if it's blue. Destroy target permanent if it's blue. Uh, four copies of Nil Spellbomb. You know, you get to blow up an opponent's graveyard if that's the thing you want to do. Yep. Uh, two copies of Flaring Pain. Not going to let you gain any life. Or that's not whatever. what that card does. Uh, oh yeah, okay, never mind. I guess they can gain life. Damage can't be prevented this turn, so <laughs> if they play Prismatic Strands, this is your this is your go-to. Yep. <laughs> Has flashback for one red. You can do it twice! You can. And uh, we got some Grizzly Bears, Yep. just for flavor. Yep. Uh, we got the Tiger Bear for luck. Draws us a card if we ever play it. <laughs> there you go. And uh, that's the deck tech for Grix's songs. I hope you're all satisfied. <laughs> hope you're ready to see some matches with this bad boy. <laughs> Oh, yeah. See you for match one. Yep.